Welcome to the CEN Show, a platform where we learn from the world community. I'm your host, Roski Mascani. And on the panel this evening, we have Brother Mishinda. Our guest this evening is Brother Hood. He's back. He's one of our team members. He's back for about the, I haven't even counted how many times he's been here to give us this excellent information about artificial intelligence. So I'm going to just hand it directly over to him and we're going to get started. Thanks for coming, Brother Hood. You can go ahead and get started. I appreciate it. I want to say peace and blessings to everyone on this call and everyone who will see this and replay on YouTube. It is an honor today to be able to share this very, very valuable information to our community and society at large. And I just wanted to um, go into it, just jump right into it. And um, I had a couple of things I wanted to share about artificial intelligence. Imagine waking up in a world where your personal assistant doesn't just follow commands, but actually understands your needs before you say anything. Predicting what you want for breakfast, organizing your day, even suggesting how to solve problems in creative ways. This might sound like science fiction, but it's actually closer to reality than you think. Thanks to a powerful development in technology called artificial general intelligence or AGI. Now let's think about this for a minute. How, how does this apply in the real world? So think about a doctor, a doctor working in a busy hospital. Today, we'll call her Sarah. Today, Sarah is faced with an unusually difficult case. She consults with her AGI-powered medical assistant. This isn't just a computer with a database, but medical knowledge. It's a system that can reason through complex sy symptoms, compare thousands of similar cases instantly, and even suggest treatments that have the best success rate for patients like hers. Sarah feels more confident in making her decision knowing that AGI has analyzed the problem from every possible angle. The patient's treatment is successful and Sarah moves on, knowing that she has a partner capable of understanding the intricacies of medical care. Or imagine another example, a farmer, we call him David. David, a farmer in a remote area, he's struggling with unpredictable weather, which affects his crops. He uses AGI-driven tool that monitors environmental data, weather forecasts, and even state of the soil. AGI offers him recommendations for when to and not to plant and water, and how to rotate his crops for the best yield. AGI represents a leap beyond today's AI, like Siri or Alexa, which follows program instructions without understanding. AGI has the capacity to learn and adapt like a human applying knowledge across different fields and reasoning through new challenges. It's not just about convenience, it's about transforming the way we solve problems in every part of our lives, from healthcare to agriculture, education, and beyond. But while AGI holds immense promise, it also comes with challenges. How do we ensure such a powerful technology is used responsibly? How do we prevent unintended consequences or misuse? As we navigate these questions, it's crucial for everyone, not just scientists and tech experts like myself, to understand what AGI means for our future, because one way or another, it will change the way we live, work, and interact with each other, as, as it's doing now, as we see. Today, this evening, we are on the brink of a world shaped by AGI. And it's up to all of us to decide how we want the future to look. So let's explore this fascinating technology together and consider how it can be used to benefit society as a whole. So AGI, which stands for and we'll get to it in the in the slides. This is basically, this presentation is basically an educational presentation I wanted to share 
some information about AGI, some of the latest things since my last podcast on, on artificial intelligence. There's been a lot of things happening. And I want to talk about the impact of new technology, Isaac Sim, and its societal transformation with AGI. So what is AGI? AGI is human-like artificial general intelligence capable of cross-domain learning and understanding. So think about it this way. Think about narrow AGI, narrow AI versus AGI. We look at a comparison. So narrow AI excels at a specific, well-defined talk within a strict boundary, like chess program that can defeat a grandmaster. They cannot apply its strategic thinking, thinking to anything else. Okay, so a narrow AGI, you're looking at something that swallow, swallows a specific task. Some of the current AI systems examples include uh, ChatGPT4 and Claude, which is one that I've been researching in the last, last year or so uh, that has some AGI examples and a lot of new things have happened with AGI uh, on these two platforms. These are large language models which demonstrate impressive capabilities across multiple domains, but still are pattern recognition systems. And the significance of AGI advancement is AGI represents a defining moment in human civilization, as it would be the first time we create an intelligence capable of matching or exceeding human capabilities across all domains with the ability similar to human consciousness. Leveraging AI for success. The, the important thing to remember here is for our success is the distinction between narrow AGI, where you have an AGI, AI that's just doing some simple tasks, where you need to emphasize on cognitive adaptability. One example of this would be anomaly detection, like an algorithm that can identify unusual patterns in network traffic, user behavior, system logs, that's dealing with cybersecurity or something where an AI is looking at malware analysis, analyze code, identify malicious signatures, classify threats or organizations to stay ahead of the curve. Or you can use it in your own household. A lot of these AI systems have artificial intelligence in them, but AGI is something uh, bigger and goes far beyond. What is the professional impact of AGI? As far as workforce evolution, it has it is transforming industries. It's transforming industries right now as we speak. You're looking at industry industry transformation from healthcare to finance. Some of the new opportunities are professionals need to adapt to new roles, focus on managing and leveraging these AGI capabilities. AI integration, you're looking at algorithms that can prioritize vulnerabilities based on their severity, likelihood of exploitation and impact on the organization. And upskilling, emphasis on acquiring skills in AI integration and understanding its ethical implications. Understanding limits. And this is what I've been focused on, understanding the limits, because I would say maybe since my last presentation de uh, dealing with artificial intelligence. There's been a lot of media hype about AI being human-like and you can trust it, but really it's it's all about reasoning and how is this AI going to reason? It's a lot more complicated and it is not human-like. human, human -like. It is simply a system of following statistical patterns. And it's trained. It's trained through massive data sets, reinforcement learning and simulation and simulations okay so we're looking at a restraining agi what does that mean importance of continuous learning cycles keep agi up to date and evolving information and behaviors and there's a lot of ethical boundaries that exist the need for clearly defined limits to prevent unintended consequences and biases we need to explain the ethical concerns surrounding agi and the importance of maintaining control and accountability. And as we see last year, the president, he issued an executive order on AI because there's so many questions, so many unanswered questions about how some of this technology is gonna, gonna work and how it's gonna be impacting society.
So what I wanted to do with this slide is I want to share with you something called Isaac Sim. And before I go into it, I just want to want you guys to watch the video. Pay very close attention to this because this is not like any other robot you've seen. This is a platform. 